Now, hey guys, welcome back to the channel, another Swiss 001 video, and someone is about to die. Jesus Christ. Uh, yeah, but whatever. Welcome back to the Flight Simulator 2020, in which we always experiment around, right? Yeah, welcome to the Los Angeles region here in this TBM 930 plane, and yeah, today we are going to do another very interesting experiment again. Now, I've already talked about this quite a bit, and that is the AI control that this flight simulator has. Yes, there's actual and artificial intelligence that can fly planes here in the Flight Simulator 2020. Let's just uh, do that real quick today. I mean, I've already done some challenges here with the AI in this Flight Simulator before. You know, for example, last week I challenged it with some very interesting emergency challenges, you know, where I just cut off the power of the engine and then the AI had to do something about it. And uh, we're entering a very interesting flight here. Am I... Oh, my frames per second there. We're gone. But another interesting feature that the AI also has is performing a fully autonomous flight. Basically, we just tell the AI where it has to bring us and from which location, and it brings us there, hopefully safely. This could be an interesting demo of what we might actually have of transportation in the future, where AI will replace pilots, right? All right, so let's just go ahead and do that real quick. Let's perform a fully autonomous flight in something like this TBM 930 here in the Flight Simulator 2020. For that one, let's actually stay here in Los Angeles. Let's just start here at St. Gabriel Valley Airport, and then the AI will fly us somewhere. Where should we go? Um, there's also Fullerton Airport. Both of these airports actually don't have very long runways. 3,100 feet? That is really not long. So this is actually interesting. Okay, there we go. We have a route set. We can set that as an arrival. 13 nautical miles of distance, that, which is around 6 minutes. That should be perfect. We have the parking spot 40 as our starting location, and ironically, parking spot 40 as our arrival location location for arrival point so this is interesting let's just go ahead and start this genuinely we don't have to do anything here now the ai is fully going to take over start the plane do everything all right now we'll come back to san gabriel here in los angeles we're in the cockpit but we don't have to do anything right the ai is now activated it is now flying the plane which is interesting yep it's actually starting the engine and it's really quick at doing that <laughs> that's very interesting and that person here is about to die again uh that's also very interesting all right, now actually this is a pushback card and he's pushing us back so that the actual AI can take over the taxi, I guess. Which is exactly what is happening right now. The AI is now putting in a little bit of throttle there. So that the plane can actually start taxiing to the pretty short runway, actually. There we go. We are moving while well, the AI is <laughs> controlling us. This is kind of interesting. Oh, yeah, there we go. The AI is actually trying to cut the corner here. Ooh, that hasn't worked. Oh, that's kind of disgusting, but whatever. <laughs> All right, there we go. We are now actually on the taxi line here. That's perfect. All right, now the moment of truth. Is it going to crash into this car? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Alrighty, there we go. We have actually taxied here all the way to the end of this runway, and I guess this plane's just gonna line up here on onto runway one, actually. And actually, this is what I've pulled up here. Um, this is the kind of like an infograph that the AI does provide us. It shows us at what stages of the flight it is in. You know, is it on the takeoff, which it, by the way, now is. It's grayed out. Or is it on cruise or descent or even approach and final, and then the actual taxi back to the gate? That is what we can find out here with this panel and as you can see we are lining up here on this runway and uh, I guess the AI is gonna take off in any second now there we go it is increasing throttle pretty slowly which is I guess what you do in a turboprop plane like this slowly advancing it to a hundred percent or something all right there we go never mind it's at a hundred percent now okay let's just see if this is gonna take off uh, fine uh, it did the technique so far is looking good a little bit right to the center line but that's no problem at all all right 90 knots, perfect speed for rotation, which was very late, and the plane is not particularly taking off. Why is it not taking off on its own? <laughs> I mean, it, oh, oh, that's almost, you know, that was actually quite close to a crash there, as you could see. Uh, I have no idea what this AI is doing at the moment. I guess it is up to something. Let's just see what is going to happen next. Now, since this is actually a very short flight, I would already recommend turning around here, actually by 140 degrees here. You know, it's actually that we are flying to our destination here. Because I have no idea what the AI is thinking at the moment, because uh, it's flying, like, genuinely directly into a mountain there. Oh, this cannot be true, right? Damn. Okay, um... Well, this artificial intelligence apparently genuinely isn't this... Uh... 
Well, it isn't very intelligent, is it? Luckily enough, we cannot actually crash into things here. And, well, maybe the mountains actually help the AI out a little bit, because now it is actually on course here to our destination. Maybe this flight can still work out after crashing into a giant mountain there, because the AI actually hasn't given up yet. And it is actually, you know, heading towards our destination. So I'm not complaining just yet. And uh, here we go. We're pretty much flying above our departure port here. I mean, this kind of long departure leg is actually not that uncommon with such a fast plane on such a short route as well so uh, genuinely I'm not completely complaining just yet all right the plane is now descending already for some reason I mean the airport is I mean it's pretty close there of course but it's not super close and there's mountains ahead and I guess that means that we're gonna crash into these mountains again that the AI really does not know what to do genuinely I mean we crash into mountains there completely like genuinely and we're literally flying a hundred feet above um, oh that is very close here to a building but at least we are kind of on track here for this airport right now that's good maybe this can still be saved by a good landing here at our uh, destination airport. Okay, something interesting is happening right now. As you can tell here, the AI is actually not on track for the airport anymore. Maybe it's preparing for the approach or something, which it probably isn't. It is probably just lost and doesn't know what to do. It's very interesting though. <laughs> Alright, but let's just, let's just wait and see. Maybe something is going to happen. I, I genuinely want to know what it's thinking right now. Uh, sadly enough, we don't have any information about that, but what we can actually do is actually just jump to the face of the final approach so that we're actually going to spawn in right in front of the runway on the final approach so that the only thing that's left is the landing. Let's just pretend that everything so far has gone very well and we've not crashed into a mountain. There we go. Welcome on final approach. That was my phone. I just go ahead and press ready to fly. Because I mean, I'm not the one ready to fly. It's the AI that has to be. All right, there we go. Um, what is it doing now? I this actually just happened, didn't it? I mean, maybe this is because it's at Los Angeles or something. Let's maybe try some other places. <laughs> yeah, this is super weird. But yeah, let's uh, do this not particularly much easier for the AI. Let's go to Courchevel Airport here in the Alpine region. And let's have us flown to some kind of destination airport here. How about this one here? This is looking nice. Let's set this one as arrival. Uh, again, this will not be particularly <laughs> easier for the AI, obviously. Since now there's mountains, but I don't care. Like at this point, I just want to see the AI I fail miserably. This is gonna be perfect. All right, now welcome to Courchevel here in the Alpine region and the weather isn't super easy either. Do I care? No, I don't. Something's weird with this plane as well, but well, it is starting its engine, so it's looking good. And uh, right now I have no idea what's going on. But I think the plane is actually coming in for some kind of takeoff very soon. This is going to be interesting. And we've got a takeoff. Flaps are out. Everything's ready. I think um, we might actually make it here on this takeoff. This is going to be interesting. All right. We have a little bit of speed and uh, the plane is going around. That is wow. All right. The plane literally gave up while taking off. And obviously that did not work at all. <laughs> the plane right now is rolling down the mountain and it's not able to stop anymore. That is like genuinely genuinely embarrassing for the AI there. But all right, let's just pretend that the takeoff here at least went fine. And let's just skip to the approach here. Um, and in some ways, the AI is going to be able to land a plane somewhat today. <laughs> Maybe it's just that the AI is not particularly good with small planes or something. I don't know. It just doesn't work properly, does it? All right, there we go. Um, I hope this is going to work. This is actually not that hard of an airport to fly into for pilots. So I don't think that the AI will actually struggle either. But it probably will if we're being honest. All right. Now, by the way, our destination airport there is to the right. Let's just see what the AI is going to do. It's already put landing gear out and there's a little bit of a hill ahead. Let's please don't crash into that one. And that that is exactly what is happening. Oh, no. Yeah, plane is crashed. That is... <laughs> Wow. Maybe autonomous flying is not particularly the future, is it? Landing at such a high profile airport shouldn't be that much of an issue, should it? All right, I have forgot to mention that we're actually in another plane right now. This is an A320, uh, which I guess uh, could also work. Let's maybe, uh, I don't know. Maybe the AI is able to fly that kind of plane a little better, which probably, yeah, that's not gonna happen, is it? Well, we are uh, flying at the moment, and uh, so far we haven't crashed into a mountain, which is good. All right, we're coming in, uh, but something's weird. Uh, the runway is obviously to the right of us. Uh, that is not that is uh, not looking good. Is the plane gonna land on the taxiway or what? Because that's actually what it's heading for. I don't know. Damn. All right. It's the tower building that oh that was really not a good landing there. Yeah, that is the future of aviation, of course. Um, 
so <laughs> yeah yeah guys thank you for watching today's video and i'll see you tomorrow as always good night